Hello everyone, this is Jerry from Onboard. Today, uh, this video is a little long. I will show you many good news for you. First one is our new item for the double one is. You can see here, this is double one is here. Uh, why we uh, now we uh, say the new double one is because uh, many uh, customers ask, ask us uh, what the difference between the double one and double one pro. And now we have all our double one double uh, update to double one S. So this is the double one S. I will show you the details inside. Let me uh, un unbox it. This is the double one S, and uh, all of this ESC have a display. Uh, we put the display here because many clients uh, before we put here. It's a little hard to read. Now you put uh, on the ESC case, you can see here. Place function same. You can see the voltage and the uh, power levels. You can see here like this. So it's in the ESC case, very easy to read uh, when you just like this. Very, very easy. So this is the W1S. And the uh, good news is uh, all of uh, other uh have like c1 mini and the uh, w1a all of them we have uh, same as as, uh, as the display on the ESC case like this so this is the w1s the w1 and the w1 pro will not serve uh, not see uh, uh, after this month uh, 20. so in the future we'll see only uh w1s And also, WIS have a eBay form. In, when you order, you can see the you can choose the ordinary grip here, and also you can choose the eBay form. So up you choose. And this all set look. Uh, now I use you all certain uh, new updated for our WIS the newest uh, technology. I will show you the details. First one is our ESC and our W1S. The speed have make uh, updated to 40 km per hour and 25 mph. So the speed is much more faster than the old ESC. So this is the new ESC you can see here. The speed is more, much more faster now. I will show you the speed testing uh, in, at the speed testing video here. So you can choose, this is for the W1S uh, ESC, you can see here, with connector, NMA connector, water blue connector here. And this is for the C1 mini uh, ESC, the speed is same. Just this ESC don't have the NMA connector here, you can see. So this is the first new update for the W1S for all of the series. And another update is uh, our waterproof technology. We, uh, we uh, before we testing many different ways to uh, waterproof because many country learning many. So now we have found a easy way to at our waterproof, high waterproof. First is our uh, EVA foam inside. This EVA foam have a new technology. I'll show you the details. We just high pho phobic uh, coating here. You can see the difference. This uh, new one you can see. It's waterproof, you can see. So water is not easy to enter into the ESC case or the battery case. You can see here, you can see it. So this is a new technology into the, just in the eBay form here, you can see it. Water will not enter inside. Another way to uh, waterproof better is our motor, you can see here. This motor, when you uh, play into the deep water, 
or on voice load easy and what is here the connection wire you can see it's we have put all some uh, waterproof glue here you can see here have waterproof glue so it's really not easy to enter into water also this glue we have added the uh, waterproof glue too so it's much more uh, waterproof than the old motor series you can see both motors have a uh, waterproof glue here and another most important is the uh, battery this is our new battery you can see is waterproof with waterproof glue you can see here waterproof glue here so when you put water we not enter inside you can see it's, it's waterproof you can see here i also will show you the video of the waterproof testing so this is the three improvements of waterproof for our onboard all series so it's much more uh, waterproof better than before so this is the second update for our uh, onboard and another one is uh, for our battery cell uh, in the market now many use LG or Sanyong or uh, other battery cells now we have a new list battery cell just uh, Samsung 30Q battery cell this battery cell is very powerful uh, output total is 13, 30 AH currents in each motor need about 12 uh, AH, so total need 24. But all Samsung 30 Q battery pack have uh, total 30 AH outputs, so it's, uh, we not have a uh, voltage sack or other problem. And also our uh, body type have two kinds: one is uh, 4 AH, another is uh, 6 AH. So 6 AH, you know, you, when you use this new battery cell is more powerful and launch also will uh, not be big difference between the LG 6.41 so I will show you the difference between the LG out and our Samsung 30Q battery cell pack the difference for climbing and other will uh, show you the video details in the future so this uh, three newest update for our onboard one is the uh, ESC speed, 40 km per hour, 25 mph. The speed is very fast now. For, for you, so, suppose this uh, high speed, we need a big, uh, better battery. So we make this battery, just the Samsung 30Q battery cell. Battery pack is very powerful. All, all sports currents can continue 30 h So this is a high speed motor with waterproof and with this uh, battery. We testing this match performance for about three months. All satisfied in different loads. So it's now it's working the best match now in the market. And uh, all, also we have uh, updated the waterproof EVA. So don't worry, you play on rainy days. But uh, be careful. Uh, warm uh, helmets and also care for the smooth of the uh, load so this all W1 is updated so of anyone you can like the W1 is now we are here testing our onboard uh, new ESC we updated the speed to 40 km per hour and uh, about 25 miles per hour it's much more faster than the old ESC now this is my colleague and his weight is about 70 kg and I will put my phone app uh, to him to test in with the GPS to test in the speed. This is the app you can see here. We, you can, I will show you the speed when he come back. This is our straight load. Very straight you can see here. Here is testing the speed. So let's go now.
39.78 almost 40 km per hour about 25 uh, miles per hour you can see here the speed so it's much more faster now and now I will show you the speed of our onboard mini you can see the onboard mini here and we have to ask him to test the speed the max speed I'm the mini testing the speed, try to catch the video of the speed change. This is the speed, the mass speed here, we'll show you here. So let's go now. So now you can see the speed here 39 89 km per hour almost 40 km per hour about 25 miles per hour So this is our onboard mini and uh, we have updated our battery waterproof uh, add a glue around the battery inside So now we are testing our waterproof how long time can put in the water then we take out check the function of the onboard so let's go test it now. See this on board, maybe in the water, you can see it. We will put about uh, five minutes. So, into five minutes, you can see. Then we take off, take it out to check the if it's work or not. The whole battery is into the water now. You can see. You can see the turn on, turn, turn on button still have LED lights. You can see it. So this means it's still working. You can see it. I just push a little remote. But don't do like this. We now testing is put in the water and check if how long time it can uh, stay safe in the water. Because many countries, many more, many many on waste loads. You can see now the LED lights still have red flashing, you can see it. Before you do this, you need uh, 
Put some more glue around the motor, the battery. We doing test noise uh, for make sure our battery is waterproof. But we can make sure the motor is 100% uh, waterproof. Now it's almost uh, three minutes now. You can see it. It's still. I checked the uh, LED lights. You can see the steer flashing. You can see it. So three minutes now. We take off. Take out checking if it's working or not. You can see. Yeah, it's still working. You can see it. This is the battery inside. And I show you the function. You can see. This is the ESC. And this motor, I show you the onboard mini. You can see. Wow, still work. Slow speed, fast speed. Yeah, good. I don't know uh, if we put longer time, it can still work, but. Usually don't play on the water load, waste load more than three to five minutes because uh, when you fast speed, maybe water enter inside. But all batteries, uh, one percent water will not enter into the battery cell. You can see. So that's our onboard battery production waterproof updated. So you can check it still have a less here. You can see the motor is still working. You can see motor is still working in the water. You can see it. Take out this onboard mini. I put into the water. You can see very dirty. Well, uh, what's many water on it now? You can see. Check inside. Still working. You can see it. I will let this board uh, onboard mini the whole afternoon testing in the mountain This onboard mini deck is very stable, even it's very fast speed. You can see. I push the whole throttle forward. It's climbing now. You can see climbing is good. And uh, along they have a more higher here, there. This uh, second here, you can see, climb very easy. We 
go to the another here, more higher. This load is uh, not like before load. This load is more flat. So our testing stress is uh, testing where is very stress. Also, no matter which item we need testing about three to six months, then sell to the markets. Now we almost arrive the higher here here. First class uh, climbing is on the mini. This here you can see here. In the video you can see how high of this here. I will show you when we climb in the on here. I show you the here of this place. This is my finger here. You can see I put a fan near the road, near the land. You can see here. I show you the. You can see it's very high here, here. And we are do testing a different part here, like thirty percent climb. Uh, this here with different part here. I will show you when we do testing. And the first is just the LG 6.4 with 30% put in our onboard mini, the, the one put in the water one. And then we will change to our newest uh, power for something battery cell, 3 0 so, uh, Q battery cell. It have uh, big current outputs, about 30 AH outputs. Also with 30% uh, power to the something says points AH body pack check if it can climb more higher than the LG 6.4 AH with 30% body power. You can see the here is very high. Most of skateboard can climb this here. And he just rolled to the top of this uh, the mountain. I just put in the water. Uh, power now is about 30% now, you can see it. 30% and voltage 36.3. My colleague will climb in now. I take one here, this two. We need to start at the flat load here. This is the here. You can see very high. Now with the onboard mini, with LG battery 6.4 with 30% power, climbing from here to there. Now it's almost double now. So you can see, okay, that place, I will make a, put one more tree there. So this is the LG 6.4 climbing here, this place from there. The Samsung Bali is about 30% uh, power now, you can see it, 36 voice. We are climbing from the same start line. Check which one is uh, climbing higher. Okay, so let's go. You can see the Samsung body climbing more faster and more powerful than the LG 6.41. So Samsung body still continue climbing. You can see it. LG body no power maybe. Oh, not enough. It's 30 percent. Before one, I put a two here. You can see this is the LG 6.4 climbing place here. 
you stop it here, you can see it. And the something is stuck here. Wow, more higher than LG bar you see, you can see it. These two difference. So you best you can buy something about the sale. 30 AH outputs. If four power is uh one percent can come this here. It's very near now, very near this here. You can see it. And we will do more testing in the future and show you more details. So it's sunshine is Go down now, we need to go back. You can see this mountain here. Okay, let's go back now.